was like, wait, I thought I hit, and oh. I was like, oh, no, not again. here we're gonna wait it's loading our comments so I don't want to start getting into stuff just yet until the comments are done I feel like we get later and later every week yeah so fine we've been oh, oh boy well um I can't do anything because my phone's hooked up to the thing I'm like oh wait it's anything uh so it snowed today um in the orchards anyway we got a little bit of snow Okay, I got a lot of snow. We're going up to Disney on ice next weekend. So we're hoping it's not snowing next weekend. No, I don't drive well in snow. Good morning, Laddie. She's always one of the first ones to I hop know. on. She's gonna have to. Hey, Hi. Karen. Hi. Um, we need to have start having guest guests in the morning. I think. Or actually, I was thinking. Remember, I was talking about I should do like surprise questions for people. I need to start doing that. I need to pay attention. Yes. So, um, okay, so we're good. Kayla, hey, uh, Natalie, hi. Um, it's time for What's in the Shop Wednesday, friends. Um, if you're new, I'm Megan from STV. Casey, hi. <laughs> um, Shanna's not here today, um, so you get just us. We're not nearly as entertaining as Shanna, I don't think. No. Well, I think you should do that, though. I think Casey, Casey needs the upper entertainment game. Maybe I should make you stand the whole time instead of sitting. Be a whole but then you can do this. <laughs> like, no. um, anyways, uh, so time for What's in the Shop Wednesday, where we show you uh, what's come in the shop for the last week or so. And um, we have made it so that you can actually shop uh, while we're on the video, while we're talking. Um, Casey, when I start talking about something, she'll push a little button and there'll be a banner that comes up across the top and um, we'll basically tell you how to buy it. Um, you just comment um, the word sold and then the size abbreviation or, or comment sold and then the number that shows up and then the size abbreviation if there is one. Um, and then in your messenger or email, you'll get like an invoice or you can just click on the um, link and you can go and pay it. Um, everything we talk about in the video is in store and online um, and in the app. This is just an easier way so you don't have to leave the video to actually go and shop. You can just like purchase it right then. Um, you have an hour um, to pay the invoice or it goes to the next person. And uh, so I think that's all the details there. And right, yeah. Got some cute stuff in. The last, well, Monday and Tuesdays um, pictures, like the photo shoot that we did for those, like I expect all of our photo shoots to be fun like that from here on out. Like, kind of set the bar a little high. <laughs> Shanna and I had a lot of fun. It was fun. Yeah. I do have some bloopers, though, that we need to, yeah, some bloopers. But, um, I don't think I really have much else to say. Uh, our sale rack, we had the fifty percent, the extra fifty percent off um, sale last week. We're actually still doing it in the store. Um, the code online is expired, but in the store we're still doing it. So um, if anybody, if you're online only and you can't come in the store and you see something in the sales section that you want to buy, holler at me and I'll hook you up with the code um, because I don't want you guys to miss out. But I just don't want to have like the codes running forever. It throws off my my stuff. So I have. Look at this. I got everything all listed. Yeah. I have my stuff together. Not really, but it seems like it. Okay. Are you ready? Uh, yeah. Actually, I need to go grab these hats. Oh, please. I think oh, yeah, I was going to grab them. Wow. But I didn't. I didn't oh, you're number. doing them first right now? Yeah, but don't click on them because they don't have numbers. Oh. I cleared it, so there's okay. nothing on there. They okay. won't have numbers. I needed my own table. I know. Feel weird. I need a table. Ah! I feel maybe we need to push this thing back so that we have more space. I feel like we're like, right here. I'm all up in your business. It's all good. Okay, I got my little note here. See, I keep stepping off camera. Okay, um, real quick, um, our Idaho hats. 
um, our Idaho Floral Patch hats that we always bring in. We just got a new um, shipment of them. Um, they, we have the regular floral patch ones, um, the dirty look ones, and then we got a couple new ones. So there's not gonna be a banner number thing for these because there's so many of them. You can just go to the website or come in here. If you go to the website, it's under Idaho, um, under that category, and there's a ton. So um, this is just to kind of show you, um, this is the regular style hat. So it's just kind of a little distressing and it has the patch on the front, the little floral patch. Um, the dirty look ones have like a darker back and they're softer. Um, they form to your head a little bit better and then they have like a, like a rusty kind of a brownish tint to them. Um, these are actually really, really popular. Um, so that's kind of the, what those look like. We got these two new ones. Actually, we got three, but Casey already snagged one. So we got sorry. two new ones. I I'm think sorry. <laughs> I think Kai wanted one of these too. Oh, my ear just got plugged. So if I'm yelling, I'm sorry. Um, I think Kai wanted one of these, so I don't, I don't remember which one. Um, so we decided to bring in a couple of the Serape ones that they make for us, um, or that they make, and see what you guys think of those. So the Serape is just the stripes. It's like Southwestern kind of style. Um, this We have this purple one, and then we have, this one is actually Serape Aztec. Um, these are the only two that are like this. Um, if you guys like these, let us know, and I will um, order a lot more of them. Um, I know that we've kind of had the floral patch ones for like a couple years. And so if you guys want something new, um, just holler and I will hook us up. So I just wanted to bring a couple in to see what they look like and to see uh, what you guys thought, so. Yeah, they're so cute. I, of course, had to start one up before they came out. I'm gonna actually go show, you talk. I'm gonna go grab, show them the one that you snagged. Yes. Um, do you like the charcoal one, Natalie? Yeah, it's super cute. Um, I'm hoping that she will bring in more because, I mean, why not have 20 Idaho hats? Because I have, um, well, this one will be one, two, like six. The, yeah, six. Woo! <laughs> I, these ones don't fit my head. Well, I have a, like a really small head, like right here. Our CC, or our, yeah, our CC Messy Bun ones fit me really good. Like the camo one is amazing, but these ones are right too big on my head. This is the one that Casey snagged. It's actually two colors, and then it's got the um, kind of Serape Aztec on the patch. Hi, we're live. It's just <laughs> um, so this is the one that Casey snagged. But so just kind of an example of um, some of them that we are getting in. Um, Casey's gonna go and help Dusty. So I'm gonna click on this. Um, so our mandala tees, which I knew was, this was going to happen because I'm wearing black enough as it is. Gosh. And then I have this. So um, I really messed it up. Our coloring. <laughs> I have a black shirt on. Um, so the black, the Idaho mandala tees that are one of our customers actually made this design for us. Um, we got in black t-shirts. Um, we do have black hoodies that are coming. Um, but the black t-shirts, I figure this is kind of like a good um, basic, like, Everybody needs a black shirt. You might as well have this cute little design on it. Um, unisex sizes, small through 2X. And this is a tri-blend, so it's like really, it's the really thin, super, super soft ones. <laughs> Natalie, you would have wanted that one that Casey sold, the hat. <laughs> um, we'll see if I can get, I'm sure they'll send us some more. Um, I just don't want like the super, super crazy ones that they have, so I'll let them know that we really like those ones. So anyways, this is our, God. My, uh, there, you can see it. Okay, that's all for the Idaho stuff. This shirt is, I think, posted on Facebook later today. Um, we really, really, really like elbow patch stuff and we haven't had any um, in a while, I feel like, since like last fall, maybe. Um, so this one is perfect for that. So it's, um, can I click on it? See, Casey's not here, I'm slacking. Um, so it has dark gray stripes down the body and the back and it has red sleeves. So this, it's not really burgundy. It's more of like a dark red and it's got gray cuffs and super cute gray elbow patches. Um, it's a raglan style like we love so much. So raglan style and elbow patches. 
Um, this one is running big. I think we got a small through large, and I actually put on a medium, and it was a little loose on me, so um, I would definitely size down. Casey's in a small, and it was pretty big on her, so. Um, and this material, it's like not really terry cloth, but it's not clingy, um, so it's like it's a good flow. Um, definitely, definitely not clingy at all. So there's that. Right. So this, um, this hoodie, I wish I'm going to have Casey come over and talk about it. This hoodie, we're calling it the quilt hoodie because it's so warm, like ridiculously warm. Um, Casey's like, I feel like I'm wearing a quilt. And it was probably like 70 something when I had her model it. So she probably hated me. But, um, so it is a double hoodie that we love so much. Um, it, it, I'm going to show you like the texture. So look at that. How cute is that? So it looks like a sweater. Um, but then the inside is like not sweater, but this is like really, really thick and it's really, really warm. Um, it has, this is a cream. It's not white, but it's cream right here. Cream, all the details right there has little, this does not open to your armpit. Um, like the other the video I posted last night, Casey. Um, and it does have the, like the slanted, strings over in the middle like that um, this is the back of it it's running it's semi loose with your normal size um, I put on a large and it fit absolutely perfect and I wasn't really sure if um, I was gonna be able to wear it because it looked kind of small on the hanger um, but then I put it on and it was literally absolutely perfect and I did do a video in it so I'll make sure that I'll show you share, share it with you guys um, but this it's so warm and it's really 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 cute look Looks, I'm just in love with it. It looks like a sweater, but it's a hoodie. My favorite. Okay. And bye, Dusty. Bye. All right. So, actually, are you, Keith? I'm gonna make you come talk about this really quick. I'm going back. Casey's fighting off a little bit of a cold. Yeah, she's healing. She can blow her nose now. Yeah. <laughs> if you ever slow down, it might actually, you might feel better. That's true. That's true. So yeah. I just told her about this, but you have to tell them what you think about this. Yeah. How, how, it, why you, why we named it the quilt hoodie? Why we called it a yeah. quilt hoodie? Because it's, it's literally named the quilt double hoodie. Yeah, because when I put it on, I felt like I had a quilt over me. Like it feels like a quilt, looks like a quilt. It's really comfy and it'd be perfect for today because it snowed this morning, but yeah, like, like I like modeled it and it was like 70 some degrees, if not hotter, and I was dying, but today would be perfect. <laughs> <laughs> so it's super comfy. I love it. Definitely for warmer weather. It has pockets, but yeah, it's, I mean, it's heavy. So like you stay nice and toasty. It would be good for like if you're gonna go cut down your Christmas tree. You don't even need a coat. I bet you could wear that and try probably be fine. <laughs> it's so warm. It is super warm. But yeah, you could. I mean, it'd be cute. Like if you put like a like a puffy vest or something mm -hmm. with it. But yeah. Where? Oh, I'm right for the mocha. Right. Yep. All right. Now we're next up. Okay. So I kind of. So I have all these kind of in an order. Uh, but I wanted, to, I put these little outfits up here because this is the outfits that we did when we did the photo shoots. And so I'm going to show you everything individually, but also kind of show you what it looks like when it's all put together. Um, so cute. <laughs> so our, the long sleeve, I think, didn't we release the black one last week? I feel like. I think yes. we did the black one last week. With the water, buffalo. Water oh, wait, ball. it's right here. <laughs> um, okay, so, um, well, both of these. Well, so I'll, the black or the, yeah, the black one will pop up on here in a minute. So this one, um, this is, so last year we had we the perfect tees um, that were pretty long. They had a really good flow, but they were pretty long. Um, and this year, we had this brand two years ago and it was really, really, really popular. The only reason why I switched is because these this brand wasn't available last year. Um, and so anyways, we're switching back to this. So 
They're fitted arms and a really good flow off the chest. Like you can see in the pictures, excuse me, sucking down the cold brew coffee. Kind of um, you can see in all the pictures that it flows really, really nice off the chest. It's kind of, we're calling it like a fit and flare style. So it's fitted in the bust and then it kind of flares out, but not like, not like pregnant baby doll type. It's like just a really nice flow. Um, it's not tight around the body like at all. Right. It is a little longer, like the back covers your butt, but then the sh but it's not like super long. Like this one is the one from last year, so it's super long on me. Mm -hmm. But these ones aren't as long, but they're really good for layering um, under vests and even cardigans because the sleeves are fitted, and so you can put them under cardigans. Mm -hmm. um, this one is mocha, um, and um, I don't know what I was gonna say. Anyways, it's mocha. It's a really good like you can compare this with burgundy and navy. And black and like literally Every everything so much stuff so we brought this one in because it's super super neutral and it goes with a lot of the stuff that we have yes and as you can see I'm all about the basics yeah we were just talking were you were you on camera when we were talking about that last no we were just talking about it was I when I said I don't remember. my style changes every year <laughs> maybe I, oh yeah yeah because Shannon was here that's yeah. right yeah so this year Casey's all about the basics so I'm letting her put stuff together like scarf with a basic and like with a cardigan and stuff so she's doing lots of like color mixing and matching and so if you like get all of your basics and then you can mix and match and make all different kinds of outfits and stuff and of course we're gonna have pattern stuff too but she's definitely doing lots of the mixing and matching stuff and give you gives you ideas of what you can wear besides like wear black with this or navy with this or whatever so um I have my list here but then I keep looking on there okay so that um, is the mocha. This is a um, new scarf. Um, it's, I think it's technically like a blanket scarf, but. It's like a shawl. It could be a shawl. Yeah. You could literally use it as a blanket. <clears throat> I was chilly outside when we were modeling and I just wrapped it around me like it was a blanket. If you guys saw her pictures in her video, she was ready to head to the Hamptons. I seen that video and I was like, Oops. <laughs> She did. I was like, wow, so she posted it. I loved it. It's so cute. Um, so this, it's not like a super big, huge blanket scarf, but it is like a shawl style. So um, it's like, you just put it like this and just wear it. I don't want to put it, on, make my hair all frizzy. But I will show you the details on it and the colors, maybe. We messed with the lighting, so it's all messed up. So it's cream colored. It's got like the mocha color in there and then like a, Tur like a light turquoise there's mint in there it looks like there's light pink there's white there's like a bunch of different colors in there um yeah i love it yeah <clears throat> excuse me so and it's got a little bit of fringe this is like it's well casey loves it it's really cute and it can go with so many colors so many things and these little floppy hats so when i had my small store i brought in a few floppy hats and people thought i was crazy um, because they were like, Casey wears those. Well, maybe I was just a couple years ahead of the time. Because now, they're all the rage. And of course, yeah. we had to bring some in. Um, we brought in three. We have this one and the black one um, in right now. And then we have a gray, super floppy one. Uh, that I don't remember where it's at in the lineup. I haven't even the... modeled it yet. Okay, so but... we have the other, another one coming later. Um, but these, I'm just going to just throw it on real yeah. quick. Super cute. I need to lose about 10 pounds in my face. Oh so, <laughs> yeah, so anyways, cute. they're really cute. These ones I'd say are like, I wouldn't say Western, like, I feel like I'm it's like. It's like an Annie Oakley, like. Yes. Um, yeah. And then the other one's more like floppy, like. Like super floppy, like floppy. I'm going to the beach. But. In the you're winter. not in the winter <laughs> um so these are like a felt wool um material and this is this is called oatmeal but it's like a heathered oatmeal you can see and then it's just got this little band right there and if you guys saw the pictures they look really really cute on everyone um and we only got like a few of each color yeah so um these are gonna be so i mean well you saw the girl they were wearing with just the these basics and then when you can wear them with cardigans or big sweaters and Good stuff. Whatever. Good stuff. Um, the black. Oh. So then here's the black one. This one is just black, um, but they do have kind of like a fuzzy texture because they're like a wool um, felt kind of fabric. Um, 
but this is, yeah, so we have the oatmeal and then we have the black. I'm just going to pull it, the dress separately, but I didn't. Okay, it's a long sleeve though. Black dress, the bustle of Okay, well I'm just going to show you guys these right here. I'll take the vest off in just a second. So we, I'm going to stand back here so we can not mess up the thing. So uh, long sleeve pocket dresses. These are similar to our short sleeve t-shirt dresses, but I feel like the material may be a little bit thicker, um, just a tiny bit. Um, they are long sleeve, they have pockets, um, they are not clingy, they're actually really loose um, with your normal size. Some people will want to size down, but if you just want it super flowy. Um, we have it paired with a buffalo plaid vest. I'm going to take the vest off for a second and show you. So this is what they look like, and they're kind of like a fit and flare kind of a style. They're fitted in the arms and across the bust, and then they're super flowy. Really, really comfortable. These, you can wear these under cardigans. Um, you can wear these with tall boots. Um, you can wear, like, we just had the vest with it. Um, literally anything. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, just throw a scarf on, which we have, we're, I'm sure we're doing pictures with just scarves. Yep. Last year, so last year we had like sweater part pocket um, dresses that were like thicker, and these ones are a little thinner. Yeah. I mean, I don't know. They're not too much like no I just like they're thicker than our t-shirt skirt or t-shirt yeah. uh, dresses but not like sweater material right. like I feel like they're gonna be warm but not like sweater right. fabric so um, and we have so we have blackout right now we'll have navy burgundy and green right I feel like maybe we got green maybe we didn't um, maybe in green. I don't know. Yeah, maybe you're right. I don't know. I can't remember. There's so many things. So much. But you know what the best part is about these dresses? They're good basic dresses, and they're only $24. Yeah. And they have we have sizes small through 3X. Um, you were in a small. Shanna was in a 2X, I think, just because of the, the chest. Um, I just feel like with all like the holidays, pictures, like family pictures, I mean, there's events. Like crazy. Well, and even like they're so <laughs> comfortable that like you throw on like tall boots and yeah. this and a scarf and like you know we're whatever yeah. or yeah. just going shopping or mm -hmm. whatever. They're just really really good. and like I said they're only twenty four bucks so um, they're definitely definitely a good basic to have. You throw leggings with it. Um, so many options. Mm -hmm. um, and then this vest went. Oh viral did you switch yeah oh. so i will call it viral oh well, not really viral but you guys went crazy so this vest um we released it friday last friday mm -hmm. and pretty much all of them sold except for Where this small one this small and then all plus sizes right uh just two x's and three x's okay so we have one small and then we have two x's and three x's yep. um they are running kind of big. Um, you should be able to size down. Shanna could wear a large um, or a 1X, either one. In the pictures, I think she wore a 1X um, just because I didn't, because it was like fitted right here. Um, and I just wanted her to go to try the 1X size. So um, anyways, they have a waterfall, like a front right here. They are like a flannel material, but they're not super thick. So um, they won't be bulky like at all. And um, they have a full back. I don't know what else to say about them, but they're so cute. And we have these paired with the well, the dress you saw, or with just like a plain black um, long sleeve. And like I would wear this with just a, this like long sleeve, and then just like a necklace. Mm -hmm. So, um, but anyways, we do have a couple of these left. They went. I can't believe how fast they went. Like yeah, they insane. went crazy. Um, and then here's the black long sleeve, just like the mocha one that I told you about. Um, the reason why it's in a different spot is because. Um, well, and also just, you know, all of the, all of our basics, all the, these long sleeves, we're bringing in a small through two, three X. So, um, the mocha one, well, we brought, oh, that's right. I was like, didn't we release some? We released navy and, um, yeah, plum or whatever that color is. What did we call it? Plum? No. Burgundy. Wine? Yeah, I think so. I think wine, yeah. So we released navy in the wine color. So, um, if you guys watched last week, you probably saw those because, I think that's when we released them. Anyway, so we have black now. So now we have black 
and mocha and wine and navy, small through 3X. And another scarf. Um, this is also a decent sized scarf. Um, this one is, I feel like this one's thicker and heavier just by holding it. It is pretty thick. Um, show you the size of it. It's about the same size um, as the cream colored one. Um, it does, it has little like tassel kind of fringe at the bottom, but it doesn't have it on the edges like the cream colored one. Um, it's got really pretty little mauve and um, cream and it's like plaid kind of sort of which I think is adorable. I'm obsessed with plaid. I love plaid and Aztec are my absolute favorites in camo. The plaid and Aztec for sure. So um, how much are our scarf? $18.95? Yeah so this one and the cream colored one are the two thickest one scarves we got in so far. Well so far. I mean the chunky but right. the rest of them aren't as thick. They're like a. They're like this. Yes. They're like more of a. They're. They're not heavy. Yeah. I mean, these are more heavier for winter and bundling up. They're so cute. Yeah. I love both of them. Both and they're actually ones. really soft. Like you look at it, and it looks like they would be like, like scratchy, but they're but not. They're not. They're not scratchy at all. They're super cozy. Yeah. Casey wore them both like all day when mm -hmm. we did pictures last week. True story. Uh, oh, so to finish off, if you guys haven't noticed, we're kind of trying to do this stuff in like outfits. Um, and so to finish off our um, black outfit, we got new booties, black booties. We call these the Millie booties. I'm not sure why. I just really like that name. Um, so these, they have the little cutout on the sides and they're like, I wanna, like a suede, but kind of not really a suede. Like, yeah. like these are like, see, yeah. yeah. And then, oh God, I need to order more of these. These are my favorite shoes ever. They're so comfortable. They're like a soft suede. Yeah, like a really soft, short suede. <laughs> what? It's a, what I say, soft suede? Yeah. Soft. Well, suede is soft. Short. Yeah, like a short suede. Anyways, um, and then black all around here. They have the back zipper. They are running true to size. Um, I don't what sizes do we get in these? I can't remember. Uh, Five through ten, maybe? Five and a half through ten. Five and a half through ten. Um, they, the heel is like a one and a quarter or one and a half inch heel. Um, but they, so we have them paired with the dress. So they're kind of like, they look dressy. But you could literally put these with boyfriend jeans or skinnies or anything. And like tone them down a little bit so they're not super dressy. You can wear them underneath, you know, your boot cuts, your flares, whatever. I'm actually wearing booties right now, but I'm wearing them underneath my pants. So wouldn't be able to tell so um yeah so these are the Millie booties and so we only have we have right now we're not gonna be ordering any more booties just so you know we have these black ones we have the taupe um Nina's we have is that oh the lace up Zoe ones um the and then the, we have like a couple pairs of brown um take a chance ones with the cutouts on them uh, but I think they're smaller sizes like five and a half or five and a half six and a half and seven and a half it looks like Anyways, we're not bringing any more booties. We will bring in tall boots, but we have to find some that we absolutely love. So speaking of that, so if you guys want to message me some like tall boots that you guys like, um, don't send me $200 pairs of boots because we can't bring this in. But I'm kind of like, I don't know, like, do you guys want like, like chunky boots? I mean, chunky like as in like moto boots or like, I don't know because there's so many different ones like the I think they're we call them the Rudy boots you guys this was before you guys but they sold out so fast but I don't know if you like I just kind of need to know like what do you guys want in your tall boots this year so message me drop in the comments pictures whatever um what are you thinking Thick. <laughs> but I mean like what but I mean like, like I don't know like tall like not, I don't know, just like, like six. Well, like not like chains and stuff like that on them. I know that, no. but like, um, like moto boots, like, no. I, I mean, know. I personally, well, I say moto boots, but like, I mean, like, I don't know how to explain it. Like, I did tall, I don't like the, as you would call them, like Pocahontas, not Pocahontas, but like, that's very racist. <laughs> 
Well. What do you mean? Like. Like. Well, it's always called them my, uh, what are they called? I don't know. Now you got me all. Like, like your snow boots? <clears throat> buckles. That's, so buckles, we tried, like, but, well, I call, when I say moto boots, everybody thinks buckles, but that's not what I mean, like, no, riding boots, that's what I mean, not moto boots, moto boots, buckles, chains, all that stuff, I'm thinking riding boots, like, basic, like, do you remember when, um, tall boots, like, first yeah. got popular, like, are we going back to that, which is very basic, mm, or, like, I don't know we, if I like the riding boots, but that's what, like, basically all boots are, like, they start from riding boots, and they turn into other things. I'll show you some boots yeah. that I like. So we're going to be on the hunt for boots because I haven't really found any that I love. Uh, Are you trying like your winter boots? Mm -hmm. Who knows it is? You got me all fringe? thrown off about... Come on. <laughs> so bad. That's not what I meant. I, I meant... Know. Well, you're dark, so it's okay. I'm fine. <laughs> I mean... No, they're not, no, not like, not like equestrian boots, no. Like, what is that? Uh, horse, fancy horse riding. Oh. Like, when tall boots first became popular with like skinnies or leggings or whatever, like, they were just kind of very basic, and then everybody just kind of added things to them and made them more fancy. Like, I don't know if we're going back to that or what. I haven't really seen any, like, boots go, like, viral. I guess I've used that word I don't know how many times today. I feel like Casey's looking for boots on her phone. Tall. We might as well talk about it and look for a See, while. like these are like riding boots. I don't like those. Like I well, don't no, that's not what I'm talking about. Uh, but like you guys can't see what we're looking at, so you don't know what's happening. I mean, these are cute. Those are cute. That's what I'm. That's what I'm talking about. They're just oh. like basic. But they're yeah. Like buckles. Yeah. Anyways, I haven't really seen like anybody going crazy over boots, so everybody just needs to. Yeah. Send me. Like I feel like right, like booties are in. Right. But like, everybody's been asking for tall boots, so. True. I mean, yeah, I don't know. Like, I feel like I, when I look around for tall boots, I have a hard time finding them because they're literally booties, like. Which is what we specialize in, is bringing in stuff that you can't get everywhere else. So if you're having a hard time finding tall boots, we need to bring them in for you. We just need to find some that we really love. Right? Yes. Correct. Yes. Okay, enough about boots. That we don't have. Okay. A um, couple more scarves really quick. And then we have a couple purses and then we are done. So. Um, our scarves. So infinity scarves. Um, the last couple years. We brought these in but not this color. Um, we had the fringe one. I don't. Or maybe we did have these last year. I don't know if we, we did. Have, do we have black last year too? I tried to find them in our system and I couldn't really tell. Um, anyways, these are called Chunky Net Knit um, because they are like a net um, and they are really, really, really soft. Um, I don't know if you can tell. There. So they're yes, really. Natalie, I agree with you. The hidden wedge shoes are cute. The high top ones. Really? Yep, that's not ever going to happen. Well, you know why? Because you can get them everywhere. True. Yep. Well, I'm gonna have to go somewhere else. <laughs> you can totally go anywhere you want and get wedge high top. So that's kind of a, like, if you're, I mean, you guys know if you guys have been around for a while, I don't want the same stuff as everyone else. So if you can go to basically any store and find something, I don't want that. So like, and if it's like those are like really the high top or the what hidden wedge things are super, super in right now. And like everybody's gonna, pretty soon you're gonna find them for $15 at, you know, TJ Maxx or Ross or whatever. Like you'll be able to get them for cheap. Yeah. If we bring them in, we have to bring in a massive amount. And then we're competing with all these other big box stores that have them for super cheap. And that just doesn't make sense to me. Oh. So I'd rather, what? That's what I was, we have booties. Right, but they're not the same booties as everyone else. True. So it's, 
we have to bring in such mass amount, like we have to bring in a huge pack of things. And like I said, if we bring in those, like why, why would you come and buy them from us when you can go and buy them for half price from like a bigger like store? Um, that's just the reality of it. It sucks, trust me, it really, really sucks for me, especially like things hit and they're like super, super trendy and I wanna bring them in. Like if I see, it just doesn't make sense to us because then we end up on the sale rack, we lose money. It's just like kind of a big, big deal. If, and I just, like there's so many options for something like that. Like what would we bring in? When you could go like to a shoe store or someplace else and they'll have like three or four options. It's just, we have to be really, really careful because you know, we, we don't sell stuff, we don't buy stuff. So we have to kind of be a little picky with what we bring in. And yes, we do have booties, but we don't have booties that are just like everyone else's kind of thing. So, um, because we need you to, we need to basically separate our, not really separate ourselves, but like, you need a reason to come here versus Amazon or like a big box store or something like that. So that's kind of the, the idea behind all of this is if I can walk into any store and see something like it doesn't make any sense for me to have it. And because we can't buy in such big amounts that we have to sell them for like a higher price than in those big stores. That's like just the reality of it. So, um, anyway, so that's that. So send us pictures of your tall boots. <laughs> uh, um, anyway, so scarves, we have uh, the ivory and black just in this style. We've had this style for the last couple of years and so, um, I only brought in a couple colors. We'll see how they do. Uh, we have a lot of other scarves we're gonna be bringing in that are different than the ones we've had in the past. And so um, if you guys end up wanting more of these, we will bring them in, but I wanted to bring in some other stuff to kind of check it out, so. Hey Shay. Casey has on a sweater from last year. It is super cute. I don't remember where we got it. I know it sold out super fast, didn't it? Like yeah. within like a day or two. Um, and I love it. I actually, I think I bought it. Well, and I've lost weight. The medium. But yeah, I, the sleeves are super long, so I just rolled them up. But I love it. I'm all about these right now. <laughs> all the basics. All the basics. She wants to be basic. Okay. I know. Here. But we'll be bringing, I mean, we're definitely searching for them this winter, so, like, Please. we do have a couple similar, not necessarily this exact. Oh, that burgundy one we just got in. We, yeah, the burgundy, and then that taupe colored one isn't, like, thick, like, oh, but right, it's right. still, like, similar. Yeah. We have a, so, so much stuff on order, this is crazy. So crazy. But, yeah. Um, okay. We're gonna switch to purses. <laughs> Um, we've gotten three new purses in the last week. Um, I can't remember if this one has, I don't think this one does. Um, so this one is, it's a taupe color, which I always bring in a taupe one because I feel like it's just like a good neutral and it's like my favorite color for my purse. So um, I can talk about it because I love it. So it's got one zipper on the outside and it has a zip top closure, which is a big deal. Um, stripes on the inside and it has two slip pockets and then it has like it's filled with stuffing but it has a zipper here and then this is a pocket and it has the side zipper too and i know it's got all the all the stuffing in it but that's the way it looks and <clears throat> this i love this color so it's like a distressed burgundy and it has a bunch of stuff in it, and so it's not like super kind of slouchy. Um, it's got brown details right there. It does have the um, crossbody strap, so you can wear it like that if you wanted, or just wear it long, or that's what it looks like right there. It has, I don't know, if, is this a real pocket? Yep, it's got a really big pocket on the front and a zip pocket on the back, zip top closure. Um, Aztec print inside and it also has it has the two slip pockets um, the side zip pocket also has another um, zip pocket right here and um, the other pocket right in between the two zip pockets and you know what it has a matching wallet we should probably put this out on display 
I didn't stuff that one. I wonder if the other one does too. Look on the tag and see if the tag says matching wallet. No. Lost in here. Has a matching wallet. Now that I've dug through all of this. Um, and it's the same price as all the other ones, but you get basically like a free wallet. So. Yeah, it's not. It's not. Okay. This one has a wallet. Matching wallet included. And we're ending with a black purse because everybody fights over the black purses. <laughs> um, this one, I know, that one, I love that color. Oh yeah, and it has zippers on the side, but they don't actually, there's no pockets. Aww, it just is like a for look. So you get that reminded me of that other one that we, the whole room. I know, that's intense. So here's the black one on the shoulder. Um, it's got gold hardware zipper pocket on the back and these are pockets they're two two different pockets on the front zip top closure and a matching wallet we need to make sure these are out on display when we put them back has two slip pockets and a side zip pocket and it just has like a well it's kind of like polka dots the black inside um jamie loves the red burgundy one Yes. So cute. I love the color. It's just like a distressed. Yeah. Kind of. And it has like a fun print inside. Aztec print. Yes. And it comes with a wallet. So cute. This cute little tassel thing. Yes. I kind of want this one instead of my other one. So the black one? I didn't see this one. I really, I feel like I need to change from black. Too. That would be a good one for I feel for all your basic stuff you have going on. Because it'll go with all the colors. I know, right? And I haven't had a brown purse in like a long time. And it has the separator that I need. Casey might buy that one. She has one in the back that's hidden, that's on hold for her. We but like, yet. there was so many purses that. Like, I, I think that I think that one, the one that you have, I think that one will sell really fast if you choose not to get it because it's so cute. Mm -hmm. Whoa. It's like a lot of stuff. Sorry. Casey's just gonna check it out. I called my husband this morning. And he answered the phone and I said, Merry Christmas. And he's like, what? I was like, Merry Christmas. And he's like, you're a dork. I'm like, it's snowing in October. So I might as well be Christmas. So cute, guys. Somebody's gonna buy it before they watch. <laughs> yes, I love it. We need it. We also have. This is not in our lineup, but I'm gonna show you this other one that we got. I don't know if I showed this. This one, I feel like this one sold. Um, so this one sold a while back. Um, but then she brought it in and traded it in for a black one. Um, and so we have this one and it's actually a pretty good size and it has cute little details on the front. Um, just a good beige color. And we have, uh, I feel like we have maybe one or two more somewhere. So Casey's making decisions. So, all right, so yep. that's all we got. We got a lot of a lot of stuff, a lot of accessories. Um, so many of you guys have been asking about beanies. Yes. Last week you guys started before it even snowed. You were asking about beanies and we are going to bring in CC beanies. Um, we are not going to bring in as many or as many styles as normal because we have found some other, um, another brand that are kind of a smaller, um, smaller brand but their stuff is so cute like yeah I want all of them they're super cute if you didn't have your little phone ear little bun thing I would have you put them on but um Shanna's mom was in yesterday and she was like oh these are so cute they're super I was digging cute. through the box today and there's so many different like colors and prints and they're fun for sure yeah 
So those, we just, we have to get those checked in. We have to, our, the CC beanies will be here anytime and we've got to just get those in um, and get them ready. So um, I don't know what else is back there. More scarves, so much stuff. Yep, like all the things. I need to go and check it. We have lots of basics coming, lots of short sleeve V-necks, lots of long sleeves, um, like these, more dresses. Um, we have some buffalo plaid. Um, we have some stripes. We have another double hoodie. We have some Aztec. I'm trying to like visually go through all the things. So, anyways, lots of stuff happening. Yes. And again, um, everything we've talked about is in store and in the online store and in the app. So um, you can go check everything out. If you guys have any questions, um, just holler at us. And um, I hope you're having a good week. And um, if you guys have any questions, if you're watching this later or whatever, just put the, um, go ahead and put them in the comments and I'll check um, comments and stuff later. So yeah, yeah, that's it. Have a good day. Happy Wednesday. Right? Yeah, it's Wednesday. Yeah, it's Wednesday. Okay. Yeah. Okay. The end thingy. Bye Doing guys. Have to roll it up. Edit. Right here? Uh, yeah. yeah. Okay.